It's Friday, October 6th, 8 o'clock in the morning. It's race day. Well, this is our team. Got in after dark and uh, set it up. So, didn't really film anything last night because um, it was dark. Got a really good night's sleep. Uh, it was nice and cool. And I got up around 7, so got maybe like 10 hours of sleep, which is really good. Uh, <clears throat> slept surprisingly well for the night before a race. Uh, usually doesn't happen. So just got up, ate a little bit of breakfast. Gonna be studying the map and looking over the course packet. Just gonna try and stay like horizontal as much as I can. I really don't wanna be up and moving around and doing a whole lot of standing and talking today. At noon we have like a lunch and then at one o'clock we have a mandatory race briefing and that's also like packet pickup time. 5.30 race check-in. It's all happening today. This is a course packet. Um, got kind of my times listed out there. I think I'm going to be hopefully headed into eight stations. I'm going to be taking a real good look at this. This is the profiles about the first 35, middle 30 miles, and then the last 35. Studying that, studying this, and also got this big map I'll be taking a look at. Starting down here, up, 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 all the way to the turnaround. Come back. That's where we are right now. Somewhere under this legend. So check it out. I'm laying here, relaxing, and I've pinned up the map so I can just look at it. <laughs> oh, hi. So the race starts in two hours. How do you feel? Three hours. Three hours. Yeah, I feel uh, nervous. Like I don't know if I've done everything, but I've obviously I have. I mean, these all look packed up, ready yeah. to go. Those are ready to go. We're ready to go drop those off, huh? I hope I put the right number on them. You did, 214. Yep. It's on there. Yep. yep. It's a pretty popular place. Five minutes to go.
What's up? Just climbing up a mountain right now. I'm at 15 miles and about four hours. Crawford Mountain. 20 mile check in. Just went through a bit of a low spot. I have five hours, 45 minutes about. This is mile 21. Got my drop bag. Right here. Gonna grab the stuff out of it. Okay. Pretty sweet. The station we got set up here. station until I see Kara and get my pacers. Two more miles. Hey, what's up? So that's basically where the video stopped. There's one more little one that I'm going to show you here in just a second of me finishing. But um, at this point, at the 50 mile mark, the turnaround, basically, um, I just ditched the GoPro. Um, the first 50 miles were so tough and I just realized that carrying it um, wasn't going to be possible for the second 50 and I just wanted to make sure that I finished this race first of all. Uh, so there's no more video until the very end, um, which I'm kind of sad about, but I did finish and I'm going to show you that footage that was taken from a cell phone right now. <laughs> it's you guys! Yeah! That's great. Go Ryan, you got it. Yeah, for sure. 
Congrats. Thank you. Way to go. Thanks. Good job. Nice race. Hey, way to go. I think you should add more rocks, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so that's it. I did it. Grindstone 100 finished. Uh, 34 hours uh, and 20 some minutes. Um, it was incredible. I can't, you know, it's really hard to put it in words at this point. But so I'm going to post another video that's going to be basically a recap, just me sitting talking. Uh, I filmed it two days after the race, uh, so I'm uh, still, it was all still, it was all still really fresh in my mind. I'm going to go into a lot of detail of everything that happened kind of along the way. Uh, so I'm going to put that link in the description and probably somewhere here on the screen. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching this video. This was my Grindstone 100. If you haven't seen all the other videos I posted of kind of training up to the race, there's a bunch of them. You should check them out. Um, thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye.